Hey y'all, I just got back from singing on Twitch. And um, so yeah, I finished Anna with an E yesterday. So that was a really good show. Um, I'm starting, uh, I mean, I'm, I'm probably about a third of the way sh through the show um, Soundtrack on Netflix, which is a really good show. Um, so yeah, I I, um, I guess this is my impressions video of um, Soundtrack so far. Um, I really like it. Uh, it's a really good music, uh, singing and dance show. They just do, um, they just do, uh, what do you call it? Um, they don't actually sing the songs. They just play the song and then they, um, what, what, what's called, uh, pretend, pretend, they pretend to sing the songs. But I mean, the, the people are probably singing in real life. It's just, it's just, they play the original song over it. And yeah, it's a, it's a romance. Um, it's a true romance. Uh, uh, I'm not going to give any spoilers in this review because I, I want you to watch it because I think it's a good show. Um. I don't think it's I don't think it's gotten that popular yet because Netflix hasn't renewed it for a second season, um, but it's really good. Uh, I mean, I, I don't I don't think it's as good as Anne with an E, but if you like uh, romance and if you like um, uh, uh, music, you like dancing, you like singing. Um, uh, it, pretty interesting characters. I think the characters are pretty interesting there. Um, I guess you'd say they're millennials. Um, I guess they're millennials. They're like in their twenties. I think the well, yeah, the characters are like in their twenties or maybe early thirties. Um, a lot of the characters are anyway. Um, they're, they're they're pretty much like millennials. Um, so the, the characters are pretty interesting. Um, um, so yeah, that's a it's a pretty good show. Is there anything else? Um, trying to think I'm trying to think um yeah so singing on twitch went well today i didn't get any new followers but i got a new follower yesterday when i um so i'm up to 26 right now so that's more than halfway to affiliate so that's pretty exciting um but yeah so i have to um i didn't get any followers today i probably didn't do that good of a job today but that's okay i'm gonna keep working on it keep trying to get better um keep trying to get to that next level um but it's pretty hard. Um, anyways, I'm, ha I'm having fun. That's the important thing. The important thing is to have fun. Um, yeah. Yeah. I did some shopping today. That was exciting. <laughs> Bought a bunch of stuff. Food shopping. Um, what else? Oh yeah, you know what I really liked? I don't think I reviewed it yet, but I really liked uh, ContraPoints' most recent video. Um, I forgot if I talked about that yet, but I, I think ContraPoints is really good. Um, she's probably one of the best uh, people on YouTube. She's like a she's she's like a pro. She's really good at it. There was a lot of controversy because um, people thought that she didn't like non-binary people. But it, they actually didn't understand. She actually used to be non-binary, and she doesn't have. It, 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 it's not that she doesn't like non-binary people. It's that there there was a misinterpretation of her tweet, which which happens a lot. So a lot of people were like canceling contrapoints because there was this um, controversy around a few of her tweets because they they didn't realize she was joking. Um, but you know there was. People thought she would she she didn't like non-binary people, which that's not true at all. That's she 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 loves non-binary people. That's that's part of the um, LGB um, LGBTQ plus is part of the plus is non-binary. Um, it's part of the part of equality. It's part of um, uh, there's a there's a lot of people like that, and it's very common. Um, yeah, so so people thought contrapoints didn't didn't like non-binary people, and like they were canceling her because they didn't they didn't even watch her videos, and it's like, okay, why would you cancel someone if you? So I, I, I guess they couldn't have unsubscribed if they didn't subscribe in the first place. It just they were trying to get other people to cancel her, other people who were fans of her. Like they were trying to get other progressives to like, just like, get out of the uh, train. Um, but, you know, I don't think it worked. 
I think she's still doing really well. Um, her last video was really good. It was about the cancel culture. Um, but the, um, but the, um, I think she's going to make a second video of that in, um, in, uh, what is it? Uh, uh, I, th I think her next video is going to be like that. I think she makes a video like every two to three months or some, maybe two to three months she makes a video. So I can't wait to see her next. She's one of my favorite YouTubers. She's amazing. ContraPoints is amazing. Uh, if you haven't checked her out, you should definitely check her out. Um, she's really good. Like she's really good. Um, so yeah, that's, can't wait to see more of what she's got cooked up. I, I, I couldn't understand the whole controversy over her. Um, like she, like a, a couple of tweets went the wrong way. You know, she probably, she didn't even mean what she said. She, it was, it was a joke that didn't work. And they're like, okay, the joke didn't work. That doesn't mean like, you know, she should be canceled or kicked off YouTube or whatever. Um, and I, I understand people were upset because you know, if you're if you're gonna be unsens if you're gonna be unsensitive about non-binary people, then you should pay a price. So I understand why people were upset. I get it. I totally get it. Um, but I just thought that it was a little bit over the top. The 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 frustration was a little bit over the top because um, it it it's like she's she's a really good um, she's really good. So I just I just think. Um, um, I just think we should support her and, and, conti and continue watching her videos because, um, yeah, she's one of my favorite YouTubers. Um, but I, I, I understand what people are saying. I understand what the non-binary people are saying about um, you can't you can't make jokes that are insensitive like that because um, that people take people take that wrong the, the wrong way when they don't know her. So now she's she quit Twitter. Okay, she quit Twitter because. You know, she doesn't want any more controversies like that. Um, so, um, I understand why people are upset. It, it's just, um, I don't know. I don't know. I get it. So, yeah. So... So the new microphone's going pretty well, I think. There hasn't been any buzzing noise when I talk, so that's exciting. Um, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Um, what else? Try to get this to like 10 minutes or something. Um, Sometimes I don't know if I should um, call my dad more frequently than I do because it's like, I know he wants to talk to me and it's like, he probably wants me to, he probably wants to talk to me every week, or, uh, but like, I just, it's just like, I don't know, he's, He's having health problems, and I, I feel bad, but I'm, I'm very focused on my career right now, and um, I hope someday I'll be able to talk to him again when I'm not working as much, um, when I'm not as busy practicing the dance routine and everything. Um, I do want to talk to him every week again. I Right now I'm talking to him like every four months or so, which I know sucks, because when you get to his age, it's like it's like a really big deal when your son doesn't call you every week like it means it like he he thinks like i'm mad at him or something but it's like i'm not mad at him at all like i'm not mad at him i'm just i just like i'm very focused on my career right now and i just i just don't want to spend time every week on the phone with him and it's like um so that's what i'm thinking um but i i, I am i'm gonna probably go, go, go switch to calling him every week as soon as i um go live with the dance routine I've been working on. Um, I am going to start talking to him every week. Um, but it's, it's just, um, I'm, I've been so busy lately that I haven't had uh, time to talk to him. Um, but I, I, I will talk to him more in the future. I, I know he has health problems, but I think that, um, I think it'll be okay. Um, so. So yeah. Um, I told you I watched the first three episodes of The Witcher. It's a pretty good show, but... I don't know. 
I, I don't know if I want to watch the whole thing. Um... And, um, so, I've been playing a lot of Overwatch. Um, I went down a few, I went down, like, 200, I went down, like, 150 in rank in Overwatch. Um, but that's okay. I will, uh, get it back up there. Um, sometimes it, it goes up and down, and it's just, I don't know, I just, it just, it's like the the winds just blowing, you know, I, I still do competitive and rank in overwatch because, um, I like to see the score. I like to see what my score is. I don't really care if I go up or down. It doesn't matter to me. It just, I just like to see the score. Even if I go back down to bronze, I'm still, I'm still, um, still gonna be pretty good. Um, okay. We're gonna cut this short today. Thank you for watching. Oh no, actually I still have one more thing. That I have in store. Thank you for watching and have a great day. And now a word from our sponsors. Are you looking for an easy way to make money online part-time? Or are you looking for a long-term career in marketing? If you click the link in the description of this video and join ClickBank University, you'll be rewarded with awesome opportunities to make cash now. They said it couldn't be done. Scientists have just found the formula for Organifi. Join the green health movement that's changing the world. Click the link in the description of this video to discover the secret to losing weight. It's never been this easy to lose weight until now. I love video games just like a lot of people. What if I told you you could get paid to play video games? You can make $50,000 a year if you become a video game tester. Just click the link in the description of this video and you can start a lucrative career testing video games. I know what you're thinking. How are you supposed to be successful like me? Well, I've written a book and it's called From Zero to Hero. And you can purchase it at the link below this video. Uh, I just started out, out I started out just like you at one time and now look at me they put me on YouTube. Order it today, change your life now. This channel is sponsored by viewers like you. I would be extremely thankful if you support me making content just like this video here. Click the link in the description of this video to support me on Patreon. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you enjoy the content. Thank you for watching and have a great day. Bye.